Hello there! The weather has been so wonderful here last few days and I've been really enjoying the sun outside. It's not so common here to get the sunlight and the blue sky all day long at this time of the year, but yeah, the last days have been absolutely fabulous. <laughs> How are you doing? I hope that you're having a great week so far. I feel like my week just went by so fast, like how my year 2020 just went so fast as well. Today, I made my own stickers for my journal. I just used my illustrations that I have already drawn and made it into the sticker sheets. It was really fun. So I thought I can share the process of me doing it and my experience. <laughs> I had this crochet themed illustration that I thought would be lovely to use in my journal because I'm so much into <laughs> crocheting nowadays and I also printed out a few more illustrations next to it like the one with llama and a sweater so I've been using similar color tones for all of my illustrations lately so they are kind of go well together next to each other I used the matte sticker paper. I ordered this paper because I wanted to be able to write on top of the stickers when I stick them in my journal. But unfortunately, the quality of the print was not as good as I have expected. I think I should have bought a vinyl sticker paper for a more colorful result. But well, this will do for now. And anyway, the sticker came out really lovely and cozy. This is the second try. I think it's looking a little better, but there's almost no difference. Strange. I don't know. Hmm. I mean, I can see that this is a little bit more saturated, but maybe this is the best it can do. I mean, this is not so crisp as when I printed on the Canon photo paper, but well, this will do. <laughs> yeah, it's really cozy and cute. And I think the size is good, so I'm gonna cut it up and uh, get decorating. I just use one or two of these and give the other ones to my friends uh, because I don't have a quick cut <laughs> or any cutting machine I have to cut it myself with a scissor One thing I noticed as I was making my November spread is that the sticker sheets are too white for the journal. I'm using the Leuchtturm 1917 notebook, which is a German brand, and I've been using the same notebook since a few years. I think this is my third one actually. <laughs> I've been using the same notebook in the same size and the same color. 
and I really like it because it's very bendable and smooth uh, on the cover and it fits in my bags really easily. It's like the perfect size for bringing along when you go out. So yeah, usually I'm too lazy to do a bullet journaling. I basically use my notebook for writing down uh, whatever, like some notes for my German studies, my to-do lists, things to buy from the grocery stores, and so on. But for this month, I thought since I'm going to be making the stickers, it would be nice to make a November, like an overview spread. So first I have the calendar that I drew on and to the right, I'm going to write down at a fixed appointment. Then below, I have three points where I will write um, three areas that I want to focus on. Then on the next page, I have a section for the books that I'm reading. So for this month, my goal is to finish reading four books. Um, it's not going to be so hard because I have downloaded this app, which is on my phone. And there I can read a lot of uh, the ebooks. And also it has a lot of the audiobooks that I nowadays really enjoy listening to when I go out for a walk. So usually audiobooks are like one hour, one and a half hours. So it's perfect for when I go out on a stroll. So where was I? Yeah, and underneath of this book section, I have a section for all the things that I want to get done this month. On the next page, I made a section where I can put the habit tracker so for example i will have a few different things that i want to get done each day like cleaning studying art and so on so that i can continue to be more consistent i don't really like having a timetable for each day but having the things in my mind that i can tick off each day kind of helps me with being a little more productive so yeah i hope that you enjoyed this video and have a wonderful rest of the day. <laughs> Bye.